Welcome to the 10th Man YouTube channel, your place for sandbox and metaverse, NFT, and gaming related content. In this video, we're going to be checking out the world letter by Lulu Land, but we're going to be doing this one a little bit different. Instead of just doing the gameplay like I usually do, we're going to go through all the secret areas and secret uh, stuff that, that this particular experience has. Lulu Land, as a creator, is famous for its, its secret quests and secret areas within their games. That's what we're going to be checking out today, and that is only what we're going to be checking out in this video. Uh, just real quickly, Lulu Land presents the world letter, a love letter to the world from the world, an ongoing art project by Kokovan? Kokovan? I don't know. Hopefully I pronounced that correctly. Anyway, let's check out the game. So the very first one is right here as you come out of the... Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pick up this quest, these quest markers. Why not? Because they'll bug the crap out of me if I don't. Um, but the very first secret, secret area is right here. If you walk behind this vending machine, you can go straight through and you end up in this little game, this little secondary game. Uh, scroll out, of course, and uh, point face towards the wall and use your, your A and D keys in order to, to jump around or whatever. And you can actually grab every one of, oh, every one of your red uh, flowers that you're looking for. You can grab all of those here. I believe there's enough flowers here for literally everything. Or to cover that entire quest, rather. And there's also a couple secret rooms in this particular area. One of them is right over here with this cat. We can get over there. There's a secret room right back here with the snowman in it. What's he saying? You're the one who's leaving, telling me to be strong. Okay. I guess he's kind of jaded. Somebody broke up with him, apparently. Uh, let's, let's go down. Actually, we need to go up. <laughs> Whatever. Wanted to try to get in here to grab these two flowers. Alright, so where do we go now? We need to go down that pipe, it seems. Or actually, I don't know, let's not go down the pipe. Let's try to go... Can I make it over there to that flower? Oh, let's see what happens. Hey, look at that. You can. We're kind of down the pipe anyway, but whatever. I was trying to get over there to that. No, man. How do we do that? Right there. I got it. And there's nothing here. Oh, there's a flower. Good enough. I just did miss two flowers right there. I don't think that's going to matter in the grand scheme. Okay, here's... See, there's a... a Looks like a, what's a, a dead flower right there. There's a secret room back here as well. Oops. I go through the right. This looks like you're going to fall, but you're not. You can actually jump over here and grab these flowers. And we also can come out on the deck here. And if we face towards the wall, that's the uh, that's the area we were in a minute ago. I can't really. There it is. Anyway. All right. So let's get out of here. Oh, 
Come on now. That's so not what I wanted to do, but we'll go back here anyway and see if there's anything cool. We want to get in that room. That's the that's the eventual goal. Oops. Come on now. I don't think I can make it over there. Oh, I see how to do it. What an idiot. things in here. This is a, again, another little secret room. It's really hard to see that. I made it to it. Just the camera angle is, is really difficult right there. Yeah, this is where we wanted to go. That's the way out right there. And that's our, uh... All of our on the red roses. That's the that, that's completed. I wonder what's up here. Let's just check that out real quick. Oh, it just takes me back to this little area. That's cool. Go and get those for the fun of it. All right, so let's get out of here. I can figure out my way back out. And this is the way out, and it takes us right back into the bus where we started. Alright, so our next little secret area is if you, uh, if you go straight out onto the beach, you will come across this little cat right here. We can walk in behind the cat. This little, I don't know, room just randomly placed out here. I don't think many people know about this one. Tomorrow be our last battle. We'll see how you... Okay, just a little little note there. But anyway, that's the uh, that's the second little area. I gotta figure out how to get out. There we go. All right, to get to our third area, uh, we go straight up the ramp as if we're going into the castle. Except you don't you don't turn left there. You you actually keep going straight up the ramp. From there, we climb this little. I don't know what we're going to call this. Hole in the middle of nowhere. Anyway, you climb up this. To this snowman. Then you can jump straight down this chimney. And it brings you in this little area. I don't think I've ever been down in this, this way. Oh, that just takes you out. Okay. What is this? Merry Christmas, Lululand. Okay. Let's get out of here. All right, so our next area is, we're actually going to go back this way, but I, I want to kind of orient everybody. I know I've cut the video here. So uh, right back there is Club Zero, uh, straight ahead of me. So if we go out, take, take the map all the way directly out of Club Zero, all the way to the end, and then follow the path around. You're going to end up in this, like, wedding area, uh, way back here in the, in the very back corner of the map. In this wedding area, there's a little cat sitting there with some, with the notes waiting for fish to fly up from below. 
I guess it's kind of signaling to you that you can go down, and you can. You can go down to this room back here with a sewing machine and a couch or whatever. It's just a, a cool little, you know, off to the side, nobody knows about type, type place. While we're in this area, we're gonna go. We're gonna go ahead and go into Bar Zero, or I've called it Club Zero earlier, but it, it was it's Bar Zero. We'll go ahead and go into here. I think most people know about this one, um, but if you don't, it's here. We'll grab the roses while we're here. Oh, oh, I haven't even triggered that quest yet. Whoops. Anyway. Yeah, so, you jump down here. Takes you on like a winding road. You, you can make it into this room, which is absolutely horrible for your GPU. Not really. It's, uh, but it is, it is very GPU intensive. Uh, but I guess this is a, a dance floor or whatever. It's pretty obvious once you're in, in, in the club that you can do that. But I figured since I was doing a secret room there, area video we would add it in anyway okay so this is actually one of my favorites uh if you go to beef plus it's it's the restaurant you can get you can get some some roses over there but one of the hints they give you uh is to find the 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 back kitchen And find the back kitchen by running around this way and jumping through that door. And this takes you on a on a an adventure, I guess we'll call it. You're actually looking for the treasure. Oh, I guess we can just jump down there. And the the best thing about this is it says but keep in mind that the true path may not always be in front of your eyes. And for this one, that's very true. If you go this way and, and you, it looks like your path is across there, and it's certainly not. You really want to jump down right here and go in. Oh, I don't know why I said going that way. I'm going to jump around. He gives us a... a Challenge to find the treasure. So we're playing paper, rock, scissors here. So this is scissors. We want to jump to rock. Go this way. Across this one is rock. So we want to jump on paper. I'm trying to figure out the best way to do this. Maybe, yeah. If I jump on that question mark, I'll likely fall through. So, here, we'll just go this way. Yeah. Going back, like that. That'll do it. We want to get up high. The idea is to get to that door over there. Now, of course, you can jump around in there and collect all the, uh... Yeah, collect all the flowers or whatever. But right back here is our treasure. This is the main, like, secret room, treasure room, or whatever. Now, there is a path you can take that that goes all the way around the room. Currently, there's nothing really going on up there, but you can jump around there if you want to. Of course, our exit is right here. Which takes us back to the train. Alright, our next little secret area, I think it's pretty well known to most people. Uh, most people who've played this anyway, but if you go into the bushes, there's, this of course is a little maze here. If you get, if you go into these bushes, uh, there's a little path right here, which takes us all the way under to the other set of the other maze on the other side. Of course, you can run around here and grab the, the grab the uh, the flowers if you haven't got them already. If you haven't got them already, you're definitely about to get them all now because once you jump down in here. There is this little secret room that has a ton of flowers in it. So if you... Yeah. I don't know what I was about to say there. But again, if you haven't already got the flowers, that, that's a great place to get them. Okay, 
Okay, the next little secret area, I think a lot of people know that know about this one as well. Uh, but if we take these little winding stairs, just to orient everybody, I'm, um... Let me, let me just jump down here, just to orient. I'm on this side of the castle, I'm taking the winding staircase up. And there's what looks like a tree in the middle of this staircase. Until you get to the top, and it's a, uh, it's a pipe, it's a tunnel. A little glitchy right there, let's, let's see if we can make this happen. Yep, if we follow the tunnel around, we end up right here. In this secret little garden area, whatever you want to call it. come out at the bushes in the secret little room Alright, another little secret area here in the bar, or bar zero, is if we go to the fireplace and walk through it, we end up dropping down, and you'll recognize this area from earlier. This is the area that we were in that started the treasure hunt, where if you, you need to jump down below you to actually do the treasure hunt. Uh, but we're not going to do that. We're going to jump across here, go the wrong way, and see what happens. Of course, we make it to this little treasure, and it rose. But I don't, I don't think it goes any further than that. All right, so that's all I know. That is the secret. Um, Area secret rooms for Lulu Land. The world letter. If you know of any more rooms in Lulu Land, uh, please let me know. I'm sure I didn't get them all. Uh, like I said, they are famous for hiding these these rooms and areas and quests within their experiences. So if you know of any more, please leave a comment down below. Let everybody else know about that as well. Thank you for watching. If you don't have a sandbox account, would like to have a sandbox account, please consider using the link in the description below. Uh, that is a referral link. It does help us out within the Sandbox ecosystem. We definitely appreciate you watching, and we will see you in the Metaverse.